What's up guys, today I'm gonna be showcasing you the all new Su-57 in Military Tycoon. Without further ado, let's just start right off here. Yeah? So the Su-57 comes with a few upgrades, uh, the gems upgrades will cost you 850 gems in total and the cash upgrades 10 million. The Su-57 only has one seat, which of course is a driver's seat, it has a top speed of 246, increased to 346 with hypersonic, and the weapon array of the vehicle consists mainly out of two weapons. One are two missiles, which each have a reload time of 10 seconds, and five bombs, which have a reload time of 30 seconds. Thing to mention is that if you were to try to fly straight up with the Su-57, you'll realize it will try to do a looping, yeah, very similar to the Su-47, which we have gotten already in game. And if you fly down, it the same goes also for that. Next up is the durability test, which we're going to do with the heat knife on the Su-57. The Su-57 survives 6 stabs from the heat knife. Here is the damage output of the Su-57. Now the question remains, is it really worth it grinding through the entire event, yeah, doing constantly daily operations yeah, to get the Su-57? Don't get me wrong, the Su-57 has a really good amount of speed, yeah, but the HP isn't as good as you would have expected it to be, yeah, and in air-to-air -air combat against an F-35 or even an F-22, this vehicle would be absolutely destroyed with its two missiles, yeah, and the bombs won't be that effective, I wouldn't see anyone using them too often. This vehicle only is a collector's item, no one will actually use this for in-game combat, yeah. That's all which I wanted to say from my side, I hope this video was kinda helpful for you, and I wish you fellows a pleasant day, and yeah.